asking his birthdays. And I said, well, how old are you going to be? And she said, four. And she said, how old are you? And I said, 70. And she said, how did you get there? And I thought that was the best idea for a book. How did you get there? But, you know, writing, it's hard. Who took this picture? I don't know. Probably one of the kids. I mean, it looks so professional with that white background. Where's the white background? It probably was professional. Somebody was doing it for a book or for an article or something. Oh. Oh. There is, that was a wonderful Owen who's now dead. And there's the test with issues. <laughs> you know, you gave me a picture that was just that, it looked like. Kind no of. Body. You don't still have them, do you? Did you online? give them back? Huh? I didn't have actual pictures. I think I just got them online. Got them online, yeah. He was the perfect puppy because he really was. He never chewed anything, never did anything wrong. However, now that he's dead, they realize that he led Tess astray, and she's a much better dog with him gone. You know how the men can do that? <laughs> <laughs> they just, just overrode her. How do you get these big prints? Well, you take them to Paradise, and you oh. ask for this kind of stock. And so I take them and show them to kids when I take my books to show them where a lot of the... So you just say, I want to color Xerox on cardstock? Yeah. Yeah, and you give them the picture, and they do it. And it's kind of good because um, um, these are all I could find. I don't know. They're misplaced in my office, which is looks like hell right now. But... Um, they love, kids love seeing your family, your dogs. Mm. And I even have some of me as a baby, which I think is a riot because they can't think of me ever being a baby. You know, they just don't think you were a baby. You were full-blown, born a writer. 